James. But James, I think what you're getting at is, is probably the right direction on it, and then that does let you know what the cost is of, of doing it. But then at least we have a justification behind the fee, and let's yeah, we just need to get the oh. information on. So in those figures. Uh, the the eight hundred thousand figure was just to add staff to ABC, not to add staff to the staff to the commission. Correct. That is correct. Those numbers, the eight hundred thousand is just for ABC. Our estimates between the Department of Health, ABC, DFA proper with respect to security, audit staff, etc., uh, are. They range between four to six million dollars a year to administer this program. With the expected revenue, tax revenue, that's the existing 6.5% of two and a half million dollars from a mature market, which is likely 18 to 24 months after the initial licenses are issued. Sounds like we're upside down. Already. I mean, <laughs> that will be a million dollar licensing fee to make up that. I mean, that's. That's kind of an interesting note. Um, and we, we can provide copies to the Commission of the information that we've used to compile that and previously presented to uh, the legislature through joint performance review. These, we, we were looking at this and we did our best, the best math we could do that we can actually show our work on how we got there. If you're trying to recoup that off of, I mean, fees, you, you, you'll kill this thing before you launch it. It may be that, and I don't know if the legislature can assist on this, but the way they're appropriating the tax money, I guess they got to go to vocational training, et cetera. The General they, Assembly does have the authority to change the disbursement of the tax percentages as well as the potential to levy a special excise tax on top of the existing sales tax. Well, it would seem to me they may need to really look at that because if this is a sustainable thing for the government, like you're saying, ABC, et cetera, you, that money can't necessarily be distributed the way the amendment says. I mean, it doesn't seem like the numbers add up. Both of those components were left by the authors of the amendment to be amended, to be changed by the legislature. That's not one of the things that is locked down and prevented from being changed. Yeah. Okay. Those num one final question, sorry. Those numbers you're, you're referring to, those don't, those don't, do they take into account any of the application fees? Uh, a little bit because of the difficulty of projecting that and exactly where this commission would land with respect to the application fee as well as then the license fee and renewals. That was difficult to pro I'd say project. We can estimate at least $300,000 of application fees will likely be seen by the commission just for the dispensaries and cultivation facilities, which will offset some of those costs. However, not knowing exactly how many people, not knowing exactly the will of this commission, that wasn't something that in, in June and July when we were doing that, we were able to. The other concern just from the people that get into business, if the, you know, if we fee this thing to death, is then their ability to charge and make a profit on it, their product price goes up so much, the black market will be like, well, here we are, wait, I mean, it, you know, we can we can screw this up for people by, by making so many fees and over regulate whatever to the point that it, it, it's not going to make a, a dent in the market, so to speak. That has been an experience with certain other states, especially as they've gone to recreational, is finding the balance between bringing people to the legal market from the existing black market. And we, I mean, the reality is there is a competitor that's simply unregulated, and that's a whole other conversation to have on it economically, but. I think that's something we all have to consider. I mean, if, you, if you're going to have it where it's, I don't know how much the stuff costs, but if this is $500 that you can go out there and get for 50 bucks, you're still going to get for 50 bucks and everyone else can go out of business. I mean, it's, it, we have to really think about that. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.